Hey guys, it's Marie and welcome. I'm really excited you guys are here with me tonight. So for tonight, I thought I would stretch out on my yoga ball a bit and just have a chat with you guys. Now, this is going to be kind of like um, a pre-warm-up video for my Patreon, which I'm shooting tomorrow because I'm excited about it. And I thought I would like walk through some exercises with you um, just to figure out what I'm going to do tomorrow so that I'm not like, well, what do I do now? Hmm, da 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 da, you know? That way I have a plan and it's down and everything just looks awesome and good and yeah. So, yeah. Oh, gotta stretch out to get limber here. Oh my goodness. And try not to fall off my yoga wall. You know, the great thing about having a yoga ball is I can pretty much work out whenever I want to. I don't have to leave the comfort of my house. I don't have to have those awkward, like, you know, gym uh, workout thingies where people are looking at you because you're a bit of a bigger person, you know? I've, I've heard so many horror stories about, you know, bigger people like me going to the gym, working out, and people laughing at them for it. And I'm just like, well, that's not cool. I mean, what if you were in their shoes, you know? Like, we can't all be born beautiful, skinny, stuck-up little bitches. I'm sorry for saying that, but it's true. Like, I know so many skinny people who are rude as fuck. Like, I, I apologize, excuse my language, but really. Um, so, I recently got a new boss. Oh, uh, well, not recently, like two months ago, okay? New boss. And <laughs> he is buff, and he looks like one of the guys in my high school that used to pick on me. And so, <laughs> he's 23 years old. Yes, I am working for a 23-year-old. I'm, I'm older than him. I have more experience under my belt, but I'm working for a 23-year-old. Like... <sighs> He just manages the store. He doesn't own it. Uh, Nathan and Ben, they're a lot older. They, they do the job. They do it great. Whatever. But they have a 23-year-old in management. So somewhere along the line, something went wrong. And this 23-year-old now has a better job than me. Well, I can't say that because I love my job. This is my job. I get to come and see you guys and do videos and just have a lot of fun making them. Paiko, that's my side job. So anyway, yeah. Um, so, ooh, what else can I do? Um, well, I guess I can get off my ball and do a little bit of a ball stretch workout thingy and we'll see if it works. I don't know if it will, but we'll see. Okay. Let's try not to kill me. For those of you who do not know what this is, this is a ball plank. And yes, I know this is a real thing because it has happened before. Only thing is, I don't have enough room to do what I actually have to do, which is get my feet off the ground. I, uh, I like doing this way where I can just roll forward, but I don't have enough room, so I can't really do it. So anyway. So usually in a yoga ball pose, you have to hold it for at least 10 seconds. At least that's the minimum requirement. 
You can go for as long as 20. However, I am not holding the ball up in the air for 20 seconds. It's just not gonna happen. Um, so you know that blizzard that I was talking about? Uh, I don't know if any of you are here from yesterday, but I was talking about a blizzard coming and guess what guys, it came and uh, I was out in it for about an hour and I kind of looked like a drowned rat when I came home, covered in snow, very, very cold, very just, um, my, I couldn't feel my fingers, they were very numb, uh, so I had to take a little bit of TLC for myself and really get myself prepared for tonight just because I was going to shoot this earlier, but that didn't really happen. So, yeah. Now I'm just like, whoa. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. Okay. because bouncing is good for your hips. Seriously, it really is, guys. Um, so when I, <laughs> I have arthritis, and so every time my, my hip starts feeling sore, I find that bouncing actually soothes it. It's very weird, but it works out the muscle in a way that it stretches it and just makes it feel better. Um, Okay, so yeah, I sorry, I got off my topic earlier, but um, when I was coming home, my, my ankle started to hurt. And I'm not talking about a little bit of hurt, I'm talking about a lot of hurt. I, I didn't want to stand up anymore. I, I almost till like, I hit the ground type thing. So um, that was a thing, and it really, really hurt. And yeah, now I'm just like, um, yeah. What do you guys think of this pose? Do you think this would be a good pose? Oh, sorry. Gotta like work it out in a way that I can't like. Ah. Okay, there we go. Oh, let's do a little bit more bouncing. Holy hips! Ouch. So yeah, anyway, um, about the cold, <laughs> there are snow drifts up to here on me, guys. Some even like up higher like this. Uh, it's crazy. If I was to go out on my deck right now, I'd probably be swamped in, swamped in snow. Uh, it does not look good. It looks like it's going to be a very terrible winter just because this blizzard came out of nowhere. And, um, you know, I wasn't really prepared for it. I actually forgot my boots at work, which was the thing. I was wearing running shoes in the snow and like my knees were covered. So yeah, that was the thing. Uh, my shoes are completely soaked. Uh, my socks soaked. So <laughs> I'm just patting myself on the back there. And uh, <laughs> it's like, good job. Way to go, Marie. You, you, you did a fine job there, buddy. Fine job. Um, also, I apologize for my voice, how it keeps changing and everything. Um, so, I'm kind of uh, sick. I don't have COVID. Trust me. I really don't. I just, I really have a sore throat. I've had a sore throat for a while now. It just has not wanted to go away. Sorry, guys. <laughs> it has not wanted to go away. And, um, yeah, so this is... This is me trying to deal with my sore throat, and I'm probably going to have a uh, Neo Citroen tonight. Try and help me sleep. Maybe, you know, <laughs> stop me from snor snoring. Um, we'll see if that works, because, yeah, that's a thing too. Um, anyway, so, uh, it's, oh, what, can, what else can I talk to you guys about? Oh my goodness, here. Um... What do you think about this one, guys? Too much? Not too much? I don't know. Let me know down below in the comments, guys. Um, let me know what else I can do. Like what other stretches or whatever 
Let's see, let's see if I can do some side stretches. I don't know if I can, but let's see. Uh, I know that they do like the side plank thing. Um, really, like, realistically, without the ball, I would not be able to do this. I have no upper body strength whatsoever. So, it's kind of like, hmm. All right, let's try this by right here. What do you think about that one, guys? Do you think that one would work? What about that? Hi, <sighs> <Hey> guys. <sighs> oh, yes. Okay. And we're back. Ooh. Let's not do that. Okay. We're just going to bounce for a bit now, guys. I think I stretched too much and I stretched something wrong. Because it feels really weird now. <sighs> okay, so note to self do not do what I just did, which was the bend back thing, because that really hurt. So we're going to be nixing that off the list tomorrow. Um, we're not going to be doing that one. But we will do some side stretches, maybe some front stretches, definitely some back stretches, because that's a good idea. And, um,. Maybe even a few yoga poses without the ball. I don't know. Uh, what do you guys think? Should I do yoga poses without the ball or with the ball or both? Let me know down in the comments below. Ooh, I have an idea. I'll start out tomorrow without the ball and then I'll bring out the ball and then I'll do yoga poses without the ball and then with the ball. It'll work out just fine. Oh my god guys, I'm so excited. <gasps> Yay! Oh my goodness. Okay, so you guys always give me my best ideas. Like coming here, talking with you and just working stuff out in my head, it really helps. So thank you guys for always being a great and wonderful listening audience. Even if I'm not talking with you guys, you guys are listening to me, and that's just awesome. So, yeah. Do do do. Okay. Let's just get some water. Hydration. It's good for the soul. Ah. And of course, I'm doing this wrong. So, did you guys see my new water bottle? <laughs> refreshing so yummy oh my goodness so what else can I talk with you guys about I think I'm done stretching now for a little while just because I hurt myself but I really do want to say, sit and chat with you guys some more so um I worked on my Harry Potter puzzle a little bit yesterday guys I love that that was awesome and had a lot of fun doing it gonna be doing another one really soon here also, if you guys want to see more video game um, chats and stuff, let me know because I'm willing to do pretty much whatever um, to chat with you guys. So yeah, um, I want to show off the new Pokemon that I got on my Pokemon Go game so we can do that. And yeah, just have a lot of fun and talk, chat, do whatever. Um, so yeah, that's the, another thing. And then I think I actually might have a panty haul from Victoria's Secret to show you guys. I'm not going to be trying those on, unfortunately, because, you know, Facebook friendly, gotta be nice. And so, yeah, but if you want to come check that out, definitely pop on over to my Patreon. They'll be all over there. And you guys, like, come join me in my little club because it's a lot of fun. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, drop a comment down below. Let me know what you liked about it. I love you guys. I'll see you all back here really, really soon. Bye guys.